I am on May the 22nd. I'm going to go ahead and finish out May. So I'm going to knit May 22nd to May 31st, 2024. So let's just dive in. Let's just start knitting the rest of the rows so we can get caught up. It's June 15th, so I'd like to finish out May. So let's get started on the rest of finishing up for the month of May. So let's get knitting. I am on May the 22nd and the temperature is 86 Fahrenheit. I'm going to use Varsity Red. So let's get our red, May 22nd, Varsity Red, temperature 86 Fahrenheit. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and knit for row one all the way across to the end. So just knit all the way across row one. Okay. May 22nd, 86 Fahrenheit. I'm using Varsity Red and I'm just knitting to the end. I'm just finishing up row one. And now I'm going to go ahead and start row two and knit all the way to the end. Just knit all the way across to the end. May 22nd, 86 Fahrenheit, Varsity Red. I'm just knitting to the end of the row, row two. And now I'm ready to start my new day. I'm just going to go ahead and cut off my Varsity Red. May 23, 82 Fahrenheit. I'm going to add on the color Rust. I'm just going to knit all the way to the end of row one. Just knit all the way to the end. May 23rd, 82 Fahrenheit. We are using the color Rust, and I'm just finishing up row one. Just knitting to the end. Now I'm going to continue row two in Rust, knitting all the way across to the end. May 23rd, 82 Fahrenheit. I'm just knitting to the end of row two with the color Rust. Knitting all the way to the end. And now I'm ready to start my new day. May 24th, 81 Fahrenheit, which means I will be using Rust. So I'm going to knit row one all the way across and rust. Just knit all the way across to the end. May 24th, 81 Fahrenheit. I'm using the color rust. I'm just knitting to the end of row one. I'm going to start row two and I'm going to knit all the way across to the end. Just knit all the way across to the end. And so I'm on May 24th right now. I'm knitting to the end of the second row. All right, so I'm just going to continue knitting to the end. May 24th, 81 Fahrenheit. I'm just knitting to the end of row two. I'm using the color Rust. Just knitting to the end. And now I'm ready to start my new day. May 25th. 82 Fahrenheit. I am going to continue knitting for row one with the color Rust. Don't need to change my yarn. So let's just continue knitting all the way to the end, row one. It's always nice when you don't have to change your yarn and you can keep going. A lot of this needs to be weaved in. May 25th, 82 Fahrenheit. I'm just knitting to the end of row one using the color rust just knitting all the way to the end now i'm going to knit all the way across for row two just knit all the way across to the end may 
May 25th, 82 Fahrenheit. I'm just knitting to the end of row two. I'm using the color Rust. Just knitting all the way to the end. And now I'm ready to start my new day. May 26, 82 Fahrenheit. So I'm going to continue knitting with the color Rust. Row one, all the way across to the end. Just knit all the way across to the end. May 26, 82 Fahrenheit. I'm knitting to the end of row one in the color Rust. Just knitting all the way to the end. Now I'm going to continue knitting row two all the way across to the end. Just knit all the way across. May 26, 82 Fahrenheit. I'm just knitting to the end of row two with the color Rust. Just knitting all the way to the end. And now I'm ready to start my new day. May 27, 80 Fahrenheit. So for May 27th, I'm going to go ahead and continue knitting with the color Rust. I'm going to knit all the way across for row one. So just knit all the way across. May 27th, 80 Fahrenheit. I'm knitting to the end of row one. I'm using the color Rust. Knitting all the way to the end. And now I'm going to continue knitting all the way across to the end for row two. Just knit all the way across to the end. May 27th, 80 Fahrenheit. I'm knitting to the end of row two. I'm using the color Rust. Knitting all the way to the end. And now I'm ready to start my new day. May 27th, 80 Fahrenheit. I just finished completing row two. I knit it all the way to the end in the color Rust. And as you can see, I've been using Rust for the last few days. One, two, three, four days. So now let's continue on to our new day. We are cutting off the rust, no more rust. So we completed May 27, it was 80 Fahrenheit and the previous days were also rust. We were using the color rust. So we used quite a bit of rust for this one. Now we have cut off rust and we're starting a new day. May 28, 78 Fahrenheit. I'm gonna add on the color orange. I'm going to knit all the way across for row one to the end. May 28, 78 Fahrenheit. I'm knitting to the end of row one. I'm using the color orange. Knitting all the way to the end. Now I'm going to continue knitting all the way across for row two. In orange to the end. I'm going to knit all the way to the end. May 28th, 78 Fahrenheit. I'm knitting to the end of row two. I'm using the color orange. Just knitting all the way to the end. And now I'm ready to start my new day. All right, I'm just gonna tie this knot again to secure my knot at the end. I'm gonna go ahead and cut off the orange. May 29. 72 Fahrenheit. I'm using the color Varsity Orange. So I'm going to go ahead and add on Varsity Orange. Just knitting row one all the way across to the end. I'm going to secure my knot. Tie it once and when I come back I'll tie it again. Okay, I'm going to continue knitting all the way across to the end. May 29th, 72 Fahrenheit. I'm using Varsity Orange and I'm knitting to the end of row one. 
I'm just continuing to knit all the way to the end, row two, varsity orange. May 29th, 72 Fahrenheit. I'm knitting to the end of row two, varsity orange. And now I'm ready to start my new day. All right, let's make sure my knot is tied again. All right, May 30th, the temperature again is 72 Fahrenheit. So I'm going to go ahead and knit all the way across for row one in Varsity Orange. Continue knitting all the way across for row one to the end of the row. May 30th, 72 Fahrenheit, I'm using Varsity Orange. And I'm just knitting to the end of row one. Now I'm going to continue knitting row two, varsity orange, all the way across to the end. Just knit all the way across. May 30th, 72 Fahrenheit. I'm using varsity orange. I'm just knitting to the end of row two. Knitting all the way to the end. And now I'm ready to start my new day. May 31st, 74 Fahrenheit. I'm going to continue knitting for row one, Varsity Orange, and I'm going to knit all the way across to the end. Just knit all the way across. May 31st, I'm knitting to the end of row one, Varsity Orange, 74 Fahrenheit. Knitting all the way to the end of row one. I'm going to continue knitting all the way across row two to the end. Just knit all the way across. May 31st, 74 Fahrenheit. I'm using Varsity Orange and I'm just knitting to the end of row two. Just finishing up the row. And now I'm ready to start my new day. I have completed May. May is all done and it's like June the 15th right now, but I completed all of May and look at all the warm colors coming in. How fabulous is that? From January all the way to May. So I have completed May and I will start again on June. So happy knitting everyone. Happy, happy knitting. And I'll see everyone next time. Like, subscribe, and have a good day everyone. Bye for now.